Hello, my name is Austin Welch. And my name is Dylan Ferris. Together, we have created Remote Chess, an IoT chess board that allows for online play with anyone, anywhere, while keeping the tactile feel of a real physical chess board. Connect with friends who share your love for chess, sharpen your skills against an AI, or learn the game for the first time, all while preserving the much desired hands-on experience. Each remote chess board has a built-in friend system. Directly invite friends you've added, and they will see a notification they can accept or decline. Alternatively, you can create a new game and receive a game code. Share this with whomever you want to play with, and you two will instantly start a game and can begin playing. You can also play with two people on a single board with a local game, or sharpen your skills against the included Stockfish AI, who is quite the challenging opponent. When it's time for you to make your move, the remote chessboard gives immediate visual feedback, showing all the legal moves for a piece. It even supports advanced moves such as en passant, castling, and promotions. When the opponent submits their move, the board will indicate the move they just made, prompting you to complete their move on your board. The bright tactile interactions create a satisfying and captivating experience for any player, no matter how experienced. To make Remote Chess a reality, we underwent an intense development process to fabricate and write all the physical parts and software necessary. With custom PCBs, 25 laser cut parts, 32 3D printed pieces, and over 5,000 lines of code written, our board is a highly complex yet stylish machine powered by the cloud. At places like the Takachali Center here in Gainesville, Instructors use chess to help build social behavior and logical reasoning in those with learning and mental disabilities. This fully interactive chess board can give students the extra physical interaction they need to help retain information, as it can be difficult to remember all the rules of chess. We hope to further address beneficial applications like these in the future. We also want to continue to make iterations on these boards and explore alternative sensing techniques in hope of reducing the size, cost, and complexity of the boards. Thank you to Texas Instruments and the IoT Students Club at the University of Florida for giving us the opportunity to participate in this competition and for providing us the materials used in this project.